cancer. I want to apologize. I ended up turning this off by accident. Here is your part two of your reading. I am so sorry. Um, I was saying maybe you were been an overgiver in the past and you felt like they gave you nothing. So if you have been in a situation, if, if I'm talking to a cancer that has been in either this specific connection or connections in the past where you have given more than you've received, you're about to receive somebody who, or in this connection, it's about to shift and you're about to receive more than you ever did before. You're not going to be the only one giving anymore. You have somebody who wants to give back to you and probably more than what you've ever experienced before. And this is going to happen suddenly if it hasn't already. You have such beautiful energy and you've gone through all that you've gone through for a reason, Cancer. This is all guided for a reason. So I'm going to pull an angel message for you right now, Cancer. What is the message for my Cancers? What message do you have for my Cancers from the angels? What do you want to tell my Cancers? What do you want to tell my Cancers? Whoa. All right. We have the transformation card here. You've, you've probably gone through a big transformation lately out of this lack and getting ready to, yeah, getting ready to have abundance. We have transformation and we have change and transition. Holy moly. This is a lot of change. Your angels are showing up to tell you that, you know what, you're on the right path and you are shifting out of this stressy energy into this peace and calm energy. And you might have been going through a lot of changes in the recent past. Wow. Change and transition and transformation. That is a big time change. You're surrounded by archangels. Thank you, Zadkiel, for supporting me in transforming my past challenges. This is a leaving past challenges behind and going into a much more peaceful place. And you have Archangel Azrael. Thank you, Azrael, for leading me safely through this change. See this? You're being led safely through this change. So whatever you're going through, Cancer, you're being led safely through it. You have the earth angel and it says, thank you angels for inspiring me to be more like you. This is your energy, Cancer. You are an earth angel. You are very compassionate and loving. You're an empath. You usually care more about others than they care. I know that that's you. <laughs> Caring more and giving more and wanting to take care of everybody before you take care of yourself, right? So you have the angels here to tell you, you are an earth angel. Don't get in your mind, Cancer, all these things and all these changes that you've been going through could have put you in your mind. The sword's energy is all in your mind. You know, overthinking, stressing out. This, your angels are telling you to be sure you count your blessings. Remember all the things that are going right through this transition. Remember that you're being given a gift and it's going to be a big, big, big gift of generousness, generosity in a relationship or in your money. Whatever is, you know, um, resonating for you because we're all different. While you're waiting for things to change and in general, you want to always count your blessings and always write a gratitude list. It says, thank you, universe and angels for bless all the blessings in my life. Remember to count your blessings, Cancer. And let's get some advice from my Cancers. Thank you for advice from my Cancers. What do you have for my Cancers for advice? Thank you for advice from my Cancers. Well, wow. Okay, let's see what we got here. Look for a sign. <laughs> look for a sign while you're counting all your blessings and everything that's going right look for a sign because you're being guided by angels you're being guided by your intuition you're being guided to this much better place let go of anything 
in the past that does not serve you any negative thinking. You had the Five of Pentacles here and it could be negative thinking that has kept you in, stuck in this energy of lack. Let go of negative thinking. Count your blessings. Let go of doubting. You trust yourself. You got trust here. Trust yourself. Trust the divine. Trust the universe. Trust your angels. Trust your intuition. You're ready. You are ready. You are ready. You are ready for this change. <coughs> Excuse me. Cancer, I hope you enjoyed this reading. I'm so sorry that it had to be in two parts. Thank you so much for being here. If you are ready for a private reading with me, go ahead and email me. That is in the description box below. Definitely leave me a comment and tell me how this resonated for you. And thank you for all your likes, shares, comments, and subscribes. I love it all, and I'll see you in the next reading, Cancer.